Right you guys, got another video here for you. Now if you're going on holiday or you're going away for a working meeting, you're going to need to create an out of office reply in Outlook and I'm going to show you how to do it in this video today. So open up Outlook, this is Outlook 2019 and we're going to go to a new email here, create a new email and what you want to do here in the subject, you want to put in here out of office, just like so. And uh, you can call yours whatever you like, but I'm going to call mine out of office here. Now what you need to do is put a little message inside this box here. I'm going to paste something in here that I've done. And this lets people know that you're going to be out of office from a certain date to a certain date. It's very simple and easy. Or you can put whatever message you like. And I'm going to be putting during this period, I will have limited access to uh, my email. Now we can go to uh, new and save as. And what we need to do here is save this as a template. So we're going to go down. So what we need to do is click Outlook Template, OFT. And uh, once you've got this saved, this will save it in the Templates folder. And this is uh, means we can call upon this at any time we like. Now we can close off the email. We don't need to keep this. So we're going to close this off because we've got the template created. So click No. Now we need to create a rule. So I'm going to go up to File. Then you should see Rules and Alerts here. Click on Rules and Alerts. And now what we need to do is create a new rule. So click on New Rule. And this will allow us to create a new rule. Now what I want to do here is apply the rule on messages I receive. And this is down the bottom here. So click on this. And this would be a new blank rule that we're creating. Click Next. Now we need to select where my name is in the To box. And we can uh, put other ones in here if you need, but I'm just going to be using this one. So click Next. And once we've got that, we need to go to where it says Reply uh, using a specific template. and. Uh, all we need to do here is go down the bottom here and click on this bit here and select the template that we just created. So you see standard templates here. We don't want that. We need to use the drop down box, uh, which is a little drop down arrow. And then we can go ahead and select our template. User templates in file system. You should see your out of office template that we just created. Now we can click on open. And once we click on open, it's going to use that path to that template that we created. As you can see here, it's added it in down the bottom. Next, we can uh, click on Next. And from here, we want to put in the Accept if it is an automatic reply. And that's what we want to do. And uh, once we've done that, click on Next. And you can run this right now on all the messages already in your inbox or you can just turn on this rule and let it run from the point of when you start uh, this by clicking finish and that's what I'm going to do here. Now if you want to stop the template from running because this will continue to run until you stop it. So you just use it up until the point when you're back and then you can turn it off. So let me just click finish here and you can click on apply and OK here. And once you've clicked on apply and OK, that rule and that um, template will be on auto send back to every email that comes in. Now click on the rules and alerts again. And if you want to remove it, you just take the tick out and uh, click apply and OK. But I'm leaving mine running and that's pretty much it. Anyway, that's going to be about it for this video. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Have a great day and I shall see you again for another video real soon. Bye for now. Now, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the big red subscribe button on my YouTube channel and hit the bell notification button next to that to be notified when we upload new videos.